We all remember the occluded artery trial called OAT. Many interventional cardiologists were disappointed in that OAT demonstrated in a 2.9 year follow-up no reduction in the composite of death, reinfarction, and class 4 heart failure if the artery was opened or not. Now in circulation, there is a report of these same patients followed up to six years to determine whether late trends would favor either treatment group. The original O trial randomized 2,200 stable patients with infarct-related artery total occlusion more than 24 hours after MI. There were a lot of exclusions in the trial, patients with severe inducible ischemia, rest angina, class three or four heart failure, and three vessel or left main disease were excluded. The extended follow-up of these patients found that rates of the primary endpoint, that is fatal and non-fatal MI, death, and class four heart failure were similar for the PCI group and medical therapy alone groups. The vast majority of patients at each follow-up visit did not report angina. The authors conclude that extended follow-up of the OAT cohort provides robust evidence for no reduction of long-term rates of clinical events after routine PCI in stable patients with a totally occluded infarct-related artery and without severe inducible ischemia in the subacute phase after MI. I'm Peter Block, and this is a CardiSource Heart Minute.